Time now for ABC4 News Sports with Dana Green. Well, Donovan Mitchell blew the NBA world away in the slam dunk contest last year, but he will not defend his title next month. Mitchell said that instead he will rest up during All-Star Weekend, but he said it was a difficult decision to make. It's tough because it's one of my favorite events. It is my favorite event in the entire in the entire weekend. So for I just wanted to, you know, to be able to be ready mentally, physically for my team. You know, obviously with the year that we've had, we haven't really taken off from the beginning like we, we thought we would have. So we need the second half of the season. And I think for me and my teammates, I think it'd be better if I was just to rest and mentally just be focused for the second half. Well, the Jazz are looking for their sixth straight win tonight as they host Cleveland. And it's a homecoming of sorts for two former Jazz players who are excited to be back at their old stomping grounds. Alec Burke spent seven and a half years with the Jazz while Rodney Hood was here for three and a half seasons. Both were traded and they say it's a little strange being back as the visitor. Yeah, definitely. Just coming, getting uh, off the plane, going to the hotel, you know, coming here in the visit locker room. I'm used to making that long walk, you know, but, you know, it should, it should be fun. Well, I'm excited to be back, you know. Um I think, you know, one thing I got to do is just focus in on what we're trying to do. But I also enjoy my time here. You know, just, you only get one first time back, you know, so I want to enjoy it. Hood and Burks understand the business of the NBA, and the Jazz were able to get Jay Crowder and Kyle Korver in those trades, but they still have fond memories of Utah. It's just bonding with the guys, you know, um, having some big games in this building. Um, you know, my son was born here, you know, um, living up in North Salt Lake. Uh, going out to Midvale, the top goal. I mean, it's just a bunch of stuff. And they're still tight with the Jazz players. Uh, I talked to them a lot, you know, because I was, uh, was, I was here a long time, so I'm cool with a lot of them, you know, and a lot of the staff, the coaching staff, you know. There's a lot of people in general out here. Donovan Mitchell credits Hood for helping him develop into the player he is today. Me and Donovan had a lot of talks last year. You know, um, I just knew he was special just from watching him in summer league last year and um, to see how he's flourished, you know, since he's been in the league. And, you know, he has a ways to go, and that's the scary part about it. So what do they expect the crowd reaction to be tonight? I think it'll be love. You know, they showed me nothing but love, and I did the same thing in the back. So I'm not expecting nothing but love, you know. Unless y'all know something different, I don't know. <laughs> No, it's going to be nothing but love.